A true man serves his wife, and his wife serves him. Asking me, does God permit divorce? Is like blaspheming. I only know in Malachi 2 from verse 16, God said he hates. Please, read it by yourself. He hates divorce. He hates divorce. What God hates, you should know. And you remember in the book of Matthew 19, from verse 5 down to 10, they were trying to put Jesus to test, asking him, is it lawful for a man? Jesus answered them there. The letter of divorce was not permitted by his father, but letter of divorce was permitted by Moses because of the hardness of hearts they had committing adultery and fornication in the wilderness. So Moses seek for a short alternative to stop such acts. He released such law to them. I know the level of divorce is excess and high. But the Bible gave us simple understanding that separation is permittable. What is separation? Separation is a medium. Once you see you are about to be killed in that home or something, there is, there is nothing on earth. God did not give common sense. It is only sheep that does not have common sense. That is why so many wise men do not eat sheep, but they train sheep. Goat, we hear they want to kill it. It will draw back. A cow will see knife. It will draw back. But a sheep, a wawasa, will see you too. Whether you use cutlass, it is, it is the only animal that has. That is why you are dealing with people that eat such things. You are in trouble. I'm not condemning anybody. I'm telling the truth. Every man. Love a woman that serves him and he serves. A man, a true man, love to serve and also to be served. When a man start making reference, telling you that we are not mates, that means you have created authority. Every man loves submission in nature. They love it. They love submission in nature. In the sense that you serve him, he serves. Sometimes you see a man will love his maid. You say, what is wrong? Why is my husband looking at the maid? The maid is submission in nature. She wants to provide an access. You see her humbling. A true man serves his wife, and his wife serves him. But a true man does not want to be commanded to be served. Willingly, true love is, I fall for you, you fall for me. I fall for you, you fall for me. I scratch your back, you scratch my back. Like yesterday, I told my family, sit down, I will do the cooking. I serve. Nobody instructed me. I want to serve, also to be served. But once you give any man instruction, the beast in him will come out. The problem in marriage is know your place. That's all. Know your place. Know your place. This is my place. This is my line. This is my no-go area. This is my no-go area. Once you leave such, sir, I was teaching my wife something this morning. I said, this is how I live 17 years sweatless life. Mommy was telling people, is there challenges in marriage before she died? She has never seen one. 
She knew her place. I know my place. And there was not one problem. We have never seen not my mother coming to settle us for one day or her family for one day. Nobody. So you start early teaching. This is my place. Don't cross here. This is your place. Don't cross here. I need this thing. Give me this one. I need that one. Give me this one. That is all. 